Okay, who's ready for Inner to win it? The atmosphere in here is absolutely electric. Thank you all for coming out and supporting Telethon. We are getting towards the close, but we've got some big, fat checks to be presented first. Do you think Matt Fuller's physical exploits outside for 24 hours were good? Wait till you see what we've got in store for you here. Are you intrigued? We've got some, uh, well, what would you call them? Foam poles with apples sitting on top. There are three along this side. There are three along the other side. We have an eight metre mat along here because we have, no, don't take the apples off, boys. You've ruined the game already. Put them down, behave, and go back to the panel. Jeez. Oh no, now these girls have to come and put their mouth where Johnny Ruffo's mouth's been. <laughs> okay, we have two young ladies ready to come out. They will be attached to each other by a bungee rope and they have to be pulling each other from side to side as they try to get the apples with their mouth and then put the apples into the bowls that you can see over here. The first person to get all three of their apples into the bowls will win. Do you want to see who our contestants are? We have from Winners and Losers, Sarah Grace, and from Saturday Disney, Candace Dixon. Give them a round of applause. Come on over, girls. Now, we've got two very petite girls of about the same size, hopefully no unfair advantage. What's it like being joined at the hip, though? I feel like we're twins. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Umbilical cord. Yeah. You are kind of twins, but you're twins who are in fierce competition with, with each other now, OK? There can only be one winner. And what I didn't mention was last time we had a bit of a mishap and we kind of gave away $50,000 too much. Oh. Oops. Uh, so, Crown have been very good about that, of course, as they always are. We're up to $450,000 within it to win it so far. One of you, whoever wins, you can get these apples into the bowl or if they bounce out of the bowl, I'm okay with that because it's going to be pretty hard. Right. The first person to do all that will be playing for another $50,000 for a total of half a million dollars. Yeah. OK, ladies, I love how excited you are now. This is going to end in tears. I can feel it. OK, good luck, girls. You ready? Let's play In It To Win It! No hands! No hands! I saw that cheating. No hands. You're only allowed to use your mouth. Gee, lucky this isn't the Olympics or Candace would have been disqualified. Hand down, young lady. Hand down. <laughs> Who can pull each other the furthest? Sarah's... Oh, <laughs> your opponent's down. Candace is down, Sarah. No hands if you can. You've got two apples down. Well done. Here comes the second for Candace as well. It's two all. We're right down to the final one. This could go either way. Who's going to win? Give them some noise. Has Candace got it? Oh, they've both got it. Candace is the winner. <laughs> well done. <laughs> well done. How difficult was that? That was so hard. Trying to make my mouth go that wide to get the apple. <laughs> Woo! Actually, I didn't even check. Who got jo You had Johnny Ruffo's apples. Had Johnny Ruffo's, yeah. And, and Rob Palmer. And Rob Palmer, yeah. It tasted a bit gross, I thought, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, something yeah, like that. Yeah, that'd be it. Sarah, thank you for being such a great sport. Actually, you're, you're attached. We're going to have to unattach you. Because, Candice, there's only room for one inside the Crown cash machine. You come on over, and I've got an employee from Crown who will come over with some money for me, hopefully. You come over to... No, you're not going to both fit. We've tried Ruffo and Palmer. They've all tried to get in there, but they don't fit. Katrina, come on out. What have you got in your hands? That's a large chair. Oh, hello. Hello. Five and a thousand, nice. I didn't realise we were jumping straight to the end here. This is just to show us what we're playing for. So have you uh, given them the 50,000 to put in this one? Yes, it's already in. OK, we've got 50,000 in there. This is what we're playing for, folks. A cheque from Crown Perth for half a million dollars. Hang on to that, Katrina. Here we go. We've got 30 seconds on the clock. Candace, oh, I thought she was holding it up already. We're 25 seconds to go. And we oh, we can see it. We can see it on the window. No, it's blown. See, you've got to be quick. You've really got to be quick to grab it. Give her a cheer, everyone. 12 seconds, counter in from 10. She got it? <laughs> How did we go? Have you got it? Have you got it in your hand? Jump on out and let's see if you've got it in your hand. I think you might. I can see a bit of blue in there. 
Come on down, Candace. Empty out your wallet or your hands in this I case. Know if I had this, Sarah was such a good help. She was trying to point to where they are, but they're going so Let's fast. Let's see. Have we got Look one? Look how much I'm shaking. You are shaking. There it is. Yeah! <laughs> Come on over. That is fifty thousand dollars. Wow. This is half a million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good reaction. We love that. Katrina, thank you so much. Crown is so generous and we really appreciate it. You're welcome. Half a million dollars for Telethon. Let's keep that total ticking along. We want a record. See you soon.